Christine by Stephen King is a classic movie about a possessed 1958 Plymouth Fury that kills people. Fortunately, in the real world, we do not have to worry about being killed by an evil car. Or do we? It just so happens Oak Orchard Police Department had a 1964 Dodge 330 limited edition car that seemed to be linked to a number of police officers committing suicide. The police department sold the vehicle. There was about 34 deaths linked to this car. When you consider all the people killed in auto accidents and while working on vehicles, it makes sense to be aware of silent killers that exist under the hood and around the car. Look under the hood of a car and you will see a number of systems and chemicals. Some are under pressure. Hopefully, the following PowerPoint presentation will make you aware of some hazards that exist and motivate you to think about safety when working on a vehicle. A number of people are unaware of potential hazards they may encounter when working on a vehicle. Information covered in this presentation is not all-inclusive, but covers the most frequently encountered hazards. In this video, by reviewing some potential hazards, the goal is to encourage those working on vehicles to first identify and consider the hazards in advance and then proceed in a safe and informed manner. If hydrogen gas is being released from a battery, the spark caused by making a final connection of jumper cables to battery terminal could result in a battery exploding. Sulfuric acid or debris getting into eyes could result in blindness. When using jumper cables, make final connection away from the battery on a metal part of vehicle that is well grounded. Always wear safety glasses or face shield when working on a vehicle, especially around the engine compartment. The air conditioning system. There is a low and high pressure side of an air conditioning system. If you damage any lines, condenser or evaporator, refrigerant under pressure could get in and damage your eyes. If there was a slow leak in the air conditioning system with engine running, refrigerant could get sucked into the air cleaner. The high heat of combustion would create phosine gas out the exhaust. This is proven deadly to those working near exhaust or in an enclosed area such as a garage. Phosine gas is extremely toxic in small amounts. Phosine gas was responsible for upwards of 85% of all deaths caused by chemical warfare in World War I. PERC found in brake cleaner also becomes phosine gas at high temperatures, a potential hazard if sprayed around a running engine. Carbon dioxide is one of the byproducts from an internal combustion engine and has caused death by displacing oxygen in enclosed areas, such as a garage. Many enclosed repair shops use an exhaust collection system to capture exhaust from a tailpipe and send it outside the building. High carbon dioxide levels can also be found in homes with a defective heater or other source. This is why many homes have carbon dioxide sensors installed that sound an alarm when levels get too high. The fuel system. There is a low and high pressure side of a fuel system. Rubber hose comes in both low and high pressure Using low pressure fuel holes on a high pressure side can result in a fuel leak, explosion, and fire. An empty fuel tank can still have fuel vapors inside that can explode if exposed to an ignition source such as a spark, flame, or by welding a hole or crack in the tank. Special precautions and techniques are used when repairing a leaky fuel tank. The engine cooling system. This is a closed system that can operate under pressure and at high temperatures. Removing a radiator cap when the engine is hot can result in hot water under pressure being released, causing burns and potential eye injuries. Engine coolant, if ingested, can be fatal. Many animals and pets that drink coolant leaked from a vehicle die as a result of kidney failure. Any leaks in the cooling system should be promptly repaired. A crush hazard. Many people have died working under a vehicle that fell on them. Do not rely solely on a hydraulic jack to support a raised vehicle, as they can fail or slowly leak, allowing a vehicle to lower onto a person working under it. Improper placement of jack stands using cinder blocks or wood to support a vehicle can lead to injury or death. Learn how to properly use jacks and placement of stands before working under any vehicle. Moving parts. 
Loose clothing or long hair can get caught up in belts and pulleys when the engine is running. Avoid this situation which could put you at risk. The fan blade turns at high speed and caution near or around the fan is advised. When people are focused on a task, it is easy for them to become distracted and reach into areas without thinking. Stay alert and do not work on a vehicle if under the influence of alcohol or drugs. From my experience, research, and observations, killer cars need some form of human interaction before a fatality can occur. Driving under the influence, unsafe work practices, in addition to being unaware of the silent killers in and around an automobile, I do know that negative energy can be captured in objects, especially metal ones, such as vehicles, rings, personal possessions. This exceeds the scope of this video, but I will leave you with some words of advice and caution. Beware of silent killers when working on a vehicle and always use appropriate personal protection equipment such as safety glasses, gloves, and respirator. If you enjoyed this video and are interested in seeing other related automotive topics, please provide a comment of topics that interest you and consider subscribing to this channel. Bye for now and I look forward to you watching other new videos when they come out.